Oh, oh, that's wet. Welcome back to another episode, folks. Wow, it's kind of smudgy. This thing really? What's wrong? Please pay inside before fueling. Are you serious? Oh, God. Why? You even check How does that make any sense at all? Please go, go over the top. I'll hold it. Oh God, jeez. Hey, it's not Are you good? Is it pumping gas? Oh, I gotta go in there and tell them to turn it on. I've never seen this before. It's like a cable that runs across. I mean, this is for semi trucks. And Paracast would drive a big fancy diesel. So we gotta go over in the diesel line. And uh, wow, it rained. It rained just a little bit on our drive. This is, um, boat is in a uh, spectacular shape here. Looking good. But if you guys are just tuning in for the first time, I'm in Florida, been here for a few days and uh, got sunburned. Yep, looking fan freaking tastic. Got sunburned and um, we're actually gonna go try to fish for some more exotic fish. You know, we've been doing some bass fishing. We're gonna go after some exotic fish. Either some peacock bass or some tarpon from the shore, actually. Eric found a guy through Instagram who's gonna take us out. Hopefully catch some fish. We don't have a whole lot of time. It's already like 2.30, 3 o'clock. Gets dark in a few hours. And I think we're still 30 minutes north of Miami, which I believe that's where we're meeting the gentleman who's gonna take us out. So with that being said, you guys enjoy today's episode. Stay tuned. 20 minutes later. Well, folks, we made it to a pond here. This is, uh, is there one right there? That kind of looks like one. We got the old bandito bug on a little finesse jig. We're going to be bed fishing for some peacocks. I see him. Oh, come on. Well, that was a good sign. Walk 10 feet and see one. See if I can get him pissed off. No, he spooked? All right, all right. On to the next one. Well, folks, like I said, we got to... Got to a pond. We're going to be bed fishing for peacocks right now. These are butterfly peacocks in Florida. I think my biggest one, maybe a couple pounds, two, three pounds maybe is my biggest one. Um, but like I said, I've just got a jig on. We're going pretty, pretty low maintenance on the gear. I didn't really bring anything. I brought a few jigs, a few pieces of plastic, some, some crack and cross and band needle bugs. And we're just going to walk the bank. As you can tell, we've got the sun kind of to our back here, shining down in the water. That's the easiest way to see them. That's also the easiest way to cast a shadow on the pond. So you wanna be careful about that. But the good news about these butterflies is, uh, the butterfly peacocks, is they're really vibrant. So they're pretty easy to see in the water. It's not like a large mouth that just is dark. And uh, as you can tell, it's kind of sandy, light colored bottom. So you can actually see them pretty stinking well. So we just we just pulled up on one, saw him. Now we're just gonna keep walking the bank. Once you see one, there's usually a couple of them. Sometimes there's a male and a female. The parrot's down there. He's, it looks like he's already flipping on one. We're just, uh, we're gonna be taking a gander. It's just a little little afternoon peacock sesh. Oh, wow. Look at all these. up. Oh, got it. Cut it down. Got him, got him. Oh, I got oh, oh, game off. That didn't happen. He hit it. Oh, he got it. Oh! oh my God. <laughs> They're pissed. Come on, P. Come on, P. Oh my, dude, they're smoking it. They're smoking it. Right away. Right away. Like, you have to set the hook as they're eating it. Got him. Oh, got him. Got him. Got him. We're hooked up. Well, oh, he's trying to get out of his mouth. He's trying to get it out of his mouth. Throw in there. Perry, throw in there. 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 He's right behind mine. Right behind mine. Right behind mine. See him? He's right. He's to the right of it now. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Here we go. Look at that. Freaking beautiful. Sight fishing. Bed fishing these suckers. That is absolutely incredible. Oh my gosh. I got him. That's a nice one, dude. Hell yeah. Look, when they're bedding, when they're bedding, their fins are black. 
See how the fins are black? Yeah. That's when that's when they're bedding. Look at that. Freaking peacock. These are butterflies, right? Well, yeah. well actually, this it, one's a, it, wait, this like, one's a popoka. It's a, listen, bro. listen, I'm the peacock master. It's a popoka because it has a black dot on its head. The butterflies don't have a black dot on their head. Okay, popoka. It's a popoka. All right, we're getting the release on this guy. Freaking beautiful. There you go, buddy. There he goes. Woo! Yo, All right. Bro, that's a big one, dude. Is that a big one? That looks pretty dang big. All right, we just spotted another one. I've already got one. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, he's gonna he's gonna eat. He's gonna eat for sure. Gonna eat. Yeah, that's a big fish. Real big fish. Sometimes you gotta kind of throw in there and just fire him up a little bit, you know? Like, dude, look at that. Ready? One more time. One more time. All right, now I'm gonna catch him. Come on. Oh, Yo, he nipped it. He nipped it. Got him. Got him. Got him. Oh, my God. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh. Okay, stay in the water. Stay in the water, buddy. Stay. Grab him. Grab him. Grab him. Yes. Dude, it's a tank. That's oh a freaking tank, bro. Look at that thing, baby. Oh, look, he's, looks like he's blind. Is he blind? <sighs> he's got kind of, yeah, he's definitely oh, got a yeah. fun going on. Little one eye wonder. Look at that thing. Oh my, you think this is bigger than the first one? For sure. Yeah. Dude, for sure. So what do you think this one weighs? We don't have a scale. Like, so we came, came with literally no Can gear. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, what, do you, what do you think he probably weighs? Honestly, like probably an actual five. A five pounder? Yeah. Oh, okay. You good? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> My uh, God, <laughs> oh, we're gonna get this guy back. Dude, this is incredible fishing. Absolutely incredible. All right, buddy. All right. Okay, chill, chill, go that way, go that way. Oh yeah, he soaked the camera there. Oh, I am bleeding, yep. Yep, <laughs> he tore into my hand, baby. Absolutely tore into it, incredible. All right, well, I see another one. There was two with it, or there was one with it, so there was two total. I'm gonna grab another Bandito bug here and uh, and rig it up and see if I can catch it. The other one looked a little bit smaller, but yeah. we're still talking, these are trophy freaking fish for around here. This is absolutely incredible. So the how I'm rigging this is just, actually I'm taking a chunk off, just taking the head off the bug and just threading it on there like you would anything else. I mean, you can use a crack and crawl. I'm sure it would work fine. It really doesn't matter what you're using. I'm just using this because it's big and bulky, poses a big threat. So when it's on their beds, they get, you know, they feel a little bit more intimidated than just something really small. So what I've been doing my strategy, and something I do for bass fishing too, but it's just kind of, you kind of chuck it out there. You kind of reel it past them, kind of let it sink down in their bed, piss them off. Just kind of do this. I mean, I'm not even trying to catch them on the first few casts. It's just, if you piss them off enough, then you can kind of guarantee you can kind of guarantee the catch if they're locked onto a bed. Now there's sometimes, especially with largemouth, they're not locked and they'll kind of just take off and you'll scare them, but does he have it? No. He bumped it, he bumped it. It's hard to see with this little chop. Come on, he's just sitting there. Come on, come on fish. Little fish, fish is locked on. All right, let me see if you can catch this thing because uh, my rod is completely toast at the moment. This fish is fired up though, I'll tell you what. I feel like we definitely should be able to catch it. Oh, there you go. Yep, there you go. You got it. You got it. <laughs> First toss in there. Yep. Look at that. So is that the female? Yeah. It doesn't have a hump. This? Yes, this would be the female. That's the female? Yeah. So I caught the male, which is the big one. Absolutely incredible. Little guy. Just a squeak, but not bad. That's dope to catch the male and the female off the bed. Yeah. Look at that fish. They're still beautiful, even the small guys. It's awesome. Well, I'm, I'm a little out of breath. We're walking back. We just got a phone call saying that they're trying to tow Peric's truck and boat with all of our stuff in it. My stuff included, Peric's stuff. We parked in a parking lot here and we walked to this pond, which the subscribers here, you know, let us in. They have permission, so we're good. But apparently where we parked the boat and truck was not legal. And uh, they just got a phone call saying that uh, they're gonna tow tow the rig. Perrick's like a mile away. So I'm walking there right now, see if they're actually gonna tow this sucker away. I'm really hoping they don't because they have literally all my luggage, laptop, 
camera gear and all. Well, uh, we're walking and there's no tow truck, but there's definitely security. How's it going? Is the resident with you? What's that? The resident with you? They're on their way. Yeah, you can't be number one. If they're gonna be with you, that's fine, but you picked the wrong part. Okay. The whole board meeting. Oh, I got you, no worries. But you see where the dock is, you see that center parking line with the soccer thing? Uh huh. Yeah. Okay, you could park over there in that stretch. Okay, got it. Okay. But the resident has to be with you guys. All got right, it. Right, okay. Right. They're on. They're literally. They're right. Yeah, yeah, we, they're right there. We, we, we talked to them. Yeah, but they're just coming. Just park it because this is gonna have. This whole thing is gonna have a meeting in the next 30 minutes. Sorry about that, guys. Right. No, no, no. You guys didn't know. You can park over there. If you we'll want. park over yeah. there. Over there on that side. Okay. On that side, you know. Cool. Who's I resident? appreciate it. He's Thank you. No, 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 no. He's no, no. they're they're back there. They're they coming. Have the car keys. Okay. Yeah, I don't have the key. I don't have the keys. Can you guys? Yeah, we'll we'll, we'll take it out. Thank you guys. Right. Appreciate it. Thank you. A few moments later. I'll call you. Yeah. I'll grab my rod. All right. Well, we got kicked out. Sparks dropped me off at another lake here. I don't know what he's gonna do. Maybe, I guess he's just gonna sit here. You can't sit here. I can tell you that much. If we got kicked out of a parking lot, he definitely can't sit here. But that's his problem, not mine. He's going to do parrot things. I'm going to go try to catch another fish before it gets dark here. All right, well, we've made it to another lake here. Like I said, we just got to catch a few more fish before dark. A couple more peacocks before it gets dark. That's the goal, folks. We got the goggin bait on top of the jig. My thumbs are absolutely just torn. I don't know how you guys catch these peacocks in the rag. I wouldn't have a thumb. Oh, my God, I wasn't recording. Are you recording now? Yeah, I am now. Okay. What? Yeah, yeah, throw him back and let's redo that. <laughs> How was I not recording? I swear to God, I was looking better and then yeah, he better. break his neck again. Wow, you guys just missed the greatest yeah, fish yeah. catch of all time. No, 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 it's fine. It's fine. You can take it out. Gosh darn it. I thought I was, you even asked me if I was recording and I said yes. Oh, for real. I thought you were. Oh. No, it's all you, dog. You, I don't, you got it. You toss him back. Well, what you guys just, what you guys just missed is, uh, me spending about 12 minutes trying to catch this fish. He, he ate it water. nine times. He chased my jig up onto the shore, I touched that you rock. you were recording. You literally were like, hey, are I you recording you. this? I said, yeah, bro, I got this. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> nope, I wasn't. I even changed the craw. I had a whole bunch of teaching segments you guys missed. Gosh, freaking darn it. I was using the bandito bug, changed the craw. Oh, that was so good. I messed up. That is my bad. All right, let's find another one. We got probably one more before it gets dark. Oh, that sucks. I don't know why I said I was recording. I wasn't. I blame it on the GoPro. I'm going to assume the GoPro just randomly shut off, but that was epic. I was, oh my God, the thing ate like nine times, blew up on it. All right. Anyways, it's okay. I caught it. It's kind of, oh, there's the one. Yeah, there's one right there. Did you see him? Did you see him? Are you recording? That's his, I am recording. That's his bed, right? Right there? Yeah, right there. Oh, there's two there. Drop it. <laughs> I saw him eat it. You're gonna hook someone when they're sleeping. Drop it, drop it. I can't see now with oh, the wind. He got it. Oh, no, he didn't have it. Oh, got him! Got him! Got him! Oh, let's go, boy! Oh, dude, he's stripping drag. He's stripping drag. Oh, let's go, son! Yeah. Oh, no. chill, 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 bro, chill. Oh, yes. Yeah, you get your thumbs torn up there, buddy. <laughs> if you volume, <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> what are you trying to tackle him or what? I'm confused. What are you trying to do here? What are you trying to do here? That's so confused. We got him. <laughs> oh my God. What is going on? I'm so confused. Do you need Do you need me to like hold something or are you good? Yep. Got him. Got him. Got him. Here we go. Hey, what's up, buddy? Dude, that's a good large mouth. That's a fatty. That's a fatty. See, this is this is like this is my game. Okay, you guys have your peacock game. This is my game. I'm not saying I know anything. I'm just saying this, these are my these are my bros. What is that? Oh, those are little um like mites. Yeah, he's got something on there. Look at that. That's a good one. A couple pounds. Yeah, he's a fat freaking fish. See, buddy. Boom! Who spotted that? Which one? You? Yeah, hell yeah. You're like, I think that's a largemouth. Threw it out there, sw swam this little jig in like a freaking swim jig. That little craw on the back was just sitting there doing its little thing and boom, he smoked it. That's sick. Is that a big one? That's a giant. Oh. Oh God. Yo, you see it, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I see him. I see him. Yo, that's a, that might be a seven. Remember, steak. Boom! 
Oh, oh, no, not like that. Not like that. But you don't gotta, you don't gotta get that mad. <laughs> Man, you you get get are you recording? Oh, I'm, I'm recording. I'm hey, recording. Shit. I swear to God, yeah. That's a big fish. Drop it. He's, he's staring at it, dude. That's a big Perk, fish. you wanna catch this fish? It's huge. Where the hell did you come from, dude? <laughs> did you walk all that? Yeah. You wanna catch this one or no? I saw one. Yeah. How big is it? It's huge. Right there. There you go, get him! Oh, oh he God. smoked it. <laughs> Yo. You guys not used to the northern hook sets or what? <laughs> no way, eats it again. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, you will. He is, he is, he is. This is, this Dude, is they're crazy. so protective. <laughs> Got him! Oh my God, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Put in the squad on. Boom, baby. <laughs> this is my third one. Probably the last one of the evening for us. I missed this fish three times. That's how. Oh! Hold on. If it goes back to the bed, you can just catch it again. <laughs> Six hours later. Man, those peas got me real good. You destroyed it. Hell yeah. I don't know how you lost it last one, but. Oh, uh, you know. How do I lose anything? It's just life. I'm beat. I mean, <laughs> can, you, can you guys tell? Can you guys tell? Do I just beat? look like I just. You look like you need. You need to take a shower. I smell. And you, yeah, you do smell, and you need to sleep here for like three and a half days. That's what you look like you need. All right, folks, well, we were back at the hotel. <sighs> what a day. It's a long day. We started off the day fishing with Lawson. In the morning, we got up early, like pretty early, fished. We fished all day. We fished until like two, and then we drove like two hours south, and then fished until dark. And, uh, and now we're here, we're back in the hotel in Miami, and I think we're gonna do the same thing again tomorrow. But today was a little bit different. I know it wasn't like, I didn't really do a ton of vlogging. It was just like, hey, we're gonna go fishing. Now we're fishing. Here's me catching a fish, and now I'm out drawing it. It was, it was a pretty quick video, but it was something that I, I've never actually done, which is peacock bass fish um, when they're on beds, which they will literally eat anything. I kinda understand how it all works down here now. Like, I understand when I see YouTube videos of people catching peacock bass on crazy things, I now understand why, because they do anything. It's like, imagine fishing for like even largemouth or smallmouth. Smallmouth are a little bit more aggressive than largemouth, but then like take that up a notch from smallmouth being aggressive, because these things like, you can literally catch it, release it, it'll swim back and you can catch it again. Like that's how crazy it is. But, but if you guys enjoyed today's episode, let me know in the comment section down below. Um, because I've never really done this before. You guys probably haven't really seen this on the channel. Last time I caught a peacock bass was in Brazil. This is in Miami, Florida, quite a bit different. And uh, it's pretty fun fishing them like this in, in catching them on beds and stuff, sight fishing, doing all the sight fishing. It's, it's pretty fun time. But like I said, if you guys enjoyed, let me know in the comment section down below and I'll do it again. Fair and I, I think tomorrow's my last day in Florida and then I'm headed out. And then, uh, and then you guys probably, well, by the time you're seeing this video, it'll be probably in like two weeks from the time I'm actually filming it. Because then I'm gonna go to Mexico with Macy and not gonna really film that much there. And then we have the Bassmaster Classic, and then we'll have Guggen Week, and then, huh? Oh, pa what's your girlfriend doing tomorrow in two days? Yeah, that's what I thought. No, no, no. Parrick's saying I'm whipped. Listen, there's nothing wrong with a little spring break, okay? Chill. You're going, you're, your girlfriend's flying down here, and you're just gonna go sit on the beach, so you can't say anything. Anyways. That's the plan. That's what you guys have to look forward to next. I guess you'll probably hopefully see another Florida video or two, depending on what we catch tomorrow. Anyways, this, this outro is just too long. I'm just dragging on. Really do appreciate the view. Thanks for watching. Peace.